Hey there, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther and today I'm going to show you how to work with the envelope, the store tool in Adobe Illustrator. But before we do that, if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. All right, so first thing I'm going to do is select the fill color as you can see here and deselect the stroke. If you have a color on the stroke, then click on none and select the fill. So the fill is up here. Go here and select the rectangle tool and just draw the first rectangle. And now I also going to draw a circle and with the ellipse tool. <clears throat> going to scale it up a little. Actually, I'm going to repaint it as white. And I'm going to place it in here somehow. Make this uh, really curvy. All right, I'm gonna go and click minus front from the pathfinder. If you don't have the pathfinder, go to Windows and select the pathfinder. Okay, now I'm gonna press T <coughs> or go to type tool and type in whatever you want. I'm gonna type in Panther my brand's name and I'm going to press and hold shift to scale it up. Something like this. I'm going to go to object, expand and click OK. Make sure that this object is on the top, on the top of the layers, not on the top of the one object on another, you know, make sure that here is on top, here is on the bottom right now. So I'm going to move it uh, to the top. And now we're good. I'm going to select both of these and go to objects, go to envelope distort and make with top object. And as you can see, it replaced uh, the form and shape with the text. And now we have this interesting thing going on. I'm going to try out eventually some more forms. Why not? I'm going to try out with a circle and see what happens. And also I'm gonna um, cut the circle in a couple of pieces. I'm gonna select the pen tool and I'm gonna make some waves. Wait a sec, that's not a pen tool. We got some Pepsi vibes going on here right now. <clears throat> Okie dokie. All right. And now I'm going, going on this on the divide. I'm going to press the divide and ungroup it. I'm going to press on these and delete them. <clears throat> I'm going to recolor all, all, all of these. Okay, I'm going to scale it down a little more. Do some more text. I don't know, just freestyle it out. Expand, object, expand, good. Let me see how I should scale this up or down. So this is going to be... Let me see, I'm gonna move these up to the top. I'm gonna select this and this, go to object, envelope distort, boom. Look how interesting this looks. I'm gonna create a new copy like this. Um,
let me try this out make with uh, okay so as you can see this one didn't work out seemed to be too small I'm gonna try it out to scale it up and do this way go to object envelope nah doesn't work that way I think this one is too small or something fishy is going on let me try this out I don't know <clears throat> seem that this doesn't work all the time yeah it works this way then um, and you know leave it like this so it seems that not it won't work all the way that we got some problems in here but yeah overall it's a pretty cool idea suggest so try it out and see what you get so yeah thanks for watching don't forget to check out the other videos and have a great day bye bye